For more videos, visit ForTheSakeOfEducation.com Alright guys, let's do this problem that says determine the length B of the triangular load and its position A on the beam such that the equivalent resultant force is zero and the resultant couple moment is 8 kN uh, meters clockwise about A because A is the only point they gave you so the force has to be going clockwise so you know F1 it's called this force F1 is the equivalent force of this triangular distributed load and it acts about one third of the long edge and you know F2 is the equivalent force of this distributed load rectangular distributed load and it acts right at the middle of this rectangular distributed force so you know that F1 has a magnitude of the area of the triangle which is 6 times b because it's the length of the triangle divided by 2 which will make this equal to 3b now f2 has a magnitude of the area of the rectangle which is 2 times a plus b which would equal to 2a plus 2b Now you know that the the resultant force has to be zero, right here in the problem it says that. So F1, let's say F1, let's say going down is positive, F1 minus F2 have to be equal to zero, they have to cancel out. So F1 is equal to F2. What does this mean? This means that, look, look up here, 3B, which is F1, has to be equal to 2A plus 2B. Actually, it's all negative. No, no, it's fine. This means that B is equal to 2A. If B is equal to 2A, this means that you can replace B for 2A and you get that this is equal to 6A. And over here, you can replace this, this 2 and you will get that this is also equal to 6A. So now, you know that the moments, the, the moment about A has to be equal to 8 going clockwise. So let's assume clockwise is positive. So it has to be equal to 8. This means that F1 times this length, and this length has a distance of 4 minus b over 3 because you know that this distance is one third of b so 4 minus b over 3 minus because f2 is trying to create a clockwise moment f2 times where is f2 being applied at 4 because it's this distance minus half of minus half of the length of the rectangle so it will be 4 minus the length of the rectangle is a plus b divided by 2. So now we're going to start replacing f1 and f2 by 6a because we found that right here. So we get 6a times 4 minus b we can replace by 2a because we got that right here. 4 over 3 minus 6a times 4 minus 3a because a plus b is equal to 3a using this equation right here over 2 and this is all equal to 8 so as you can see you can start solving this you're going to get that 24a by distributing the 6a over here minus 4a square minus 24a plus 9a square so the 24 a's cancel each other out and you get that this is 5 a squared and on the left side we have the 8 so when you solve for a you're gonna get that it is equal to 1.265 meters 
and you know that if you multiply by 2 you get b so this times 2 is equal to 2.53 meters final answer for a final answer for b please comment below if you want me to do any problems and i'll be happy to help thank you